speaking about the cosmic side and the bigger world out there, the Eternals. It looks like there's multiple Eternals returning to shoot various different things from Marvel Studios soon. Uh, one, we already talked about how Icarus, at least a stunt double, is doing something for Marvel Studios soon. And this year, it looks like uh, the actor who played Gilgamesh is doing something Marvel Studios this summer as that's hmm. kind of out there now. Like, he's a South Korean actor that people discovered, oh, he's going to be coming to work in the United States because he's applying for the visas and everything. And this is usually made sort of public because of foreign actors coming to the U.S. That's a lot of times that's how we learn about roles. It's like, oh, this actor hmm. just happened to land in Australia and had to get a visa. We know what's going on, right? So, like, um, I mean... I think I'm really excited by this just by the idea of I don't have to wait till whenever the next Eternals film happens to see more of these characters. Like, I want them to become, you know, part of the MCU universe faster and interact with the characters sooner than it took Guardians and the Avengers. Because that was like, what, five years, six yeah. years wait? You're like, come on, just cross over already. Like, mm. I want it faster. The, the, prob the problem there is they're not in any real sort of situation to do that the only one that can be is icarus yeah yeah no but spoilers the two of them died i mean yeah. I suppose you could have sprite in a way icarus and sprite having a little show up somewhere can can one of the disney shows afford that cg on down like up sizing the head and all those powers because i'm not sure i'm still convinced that there was cg used on sprite's head it just didn't look right for some reason well no it's because she's a, a child and kids heads are always bigger than everything else okay i'll believe that you're probably telling the truth i won't fact check this um i mean look at look at literally look at everything yeah that's yeah that is true yeah you look at a baby the heads are huge. yeah that's true <laughs> uh so i guess the bigger question is what projects are they returning in because icarus and gilgamesh both dead quote unquote but you know um new versions one's of them. definitely dead the other one it wasn't clear no. yeah and also you could just restore their body right or do whatever i mean yeah but then that was like at least we gilg like let's just say hypothetically gilgamesh is the only one that's dead yeah if he's if he gets restored we know they get restored in the world forge which yep. is off somewhere in space so that's a plot point for the sequel surely you yeah exactly so what unless there's a flashback or a multiverse thing which then it's like okay do there you toss is him, that yeah do you toss them into loki then it's like oh look possibly variant yeah. that'd be fun yeah gilgamesh is a variant of loki i will take it <laughs> i will take it i take it i take it well he was honestly one of my favorite parts of that film like his energy and just he was, he was fun fun character so then i was really i felt sorry for him when he dropped the pie yeah my heart yeah. went the same way as the pie. It's just like, oh. <laughs> yep. <laughs> no kill. Oh. No, I actually don't know where they could show up. No. I mean, for all... It doesn't we... help. We don't, like, everything you... You can look at everything ever now. So it's like, well, they don't really fit anywhere in there. Yeah. But I feel like it's going to be this year after they do the, their big announcement. Then we might get a better idea. I was going to say, because this summer we have D23. And this is the one we're expecting another giant rollout. Because by this D23... They will officially have What's started Comic Con. Yeah, yeah. And I mean, this summer they've officially started production or wrap production on everything they announced that D twenty three from like two and a half years ago. So yeah, it's yeah. going to be about time where you know we get a giant blowout of hey guys, here's fifteen more projects. Now be quiet and wait a couple years, right? Yeah. So, <laughs> um, I get... uh, that's kind of nuts that everything I've announced is virtually done. Everything is... they've Miss. has Armor Wars started yet? That that was supposed to start, but it got bumped into like what seems like the next couple yeah. months. Yeah. And what's more interesting about this is everything they announced three months prior to the announcement of Green Lantern and Strange Adventures has oh. happened, and those shows are still just sitting there. Yeah. So oh, poor Green Lantern. Yeah, I'm really sad about that character. But hey, what do you know? What what do you know? 